with Robbie. Always nice to win a game, especially against Chester. How are you feeling right now? Um, yeah, I'm buzzing. I'm really buzzing, to be honest. Uh, my phone hasn't stopped. Um, my mates, obviously, you know, they're Wrexham fans, texting me and all that, asking uh, what was the goal like and all that, because I couldn't make it. But no, I scored against Tramia at the start of the season. I thought that was a, a great feeling, but I didn't expect myself to score against Chester, and now I did. Yeah, words can't describe it, how I'm feeling, definitely. <laughs> And of course, being a local boy, it means a lot more to you. Can you just sense the, the pride now? Yeah, I did at the start of the game. As soon as the game started, they started singing my, um, you know, obviously, my song. And um, that gave me, you know, a little ten, you know, extra 10%. And then when I got the goal, honestly, I didn't know what to do. I didn't know whether to run over to my family, run over to the corner. No, I just got absolutely uh, moulded by the lads. <laughs> but like I said, I can't, you know, it's. It's, I'm not really, you know, I'm buzzing that I scored, but I think, you know, getting another clean sheet and beating Chester three 0 perfect day. Yeah, and it's almost eleven hours, almost eleven hours with a clean sheet now that we haven't let a goal in six hundred and sixty-three minutes or yeah. something. So exactly that. That um, I, I, like I said to the lads, I said this game couldn't come at a better time. The um, the former in unbeaten, I think is it nine games now, clean sheet in what six or five games obviously before today, and they couldn't come at a perfect time. And as soon as the game started. I thought we had, you know, we had a, ch I had some, a chance myself, Connor Jennings at the bar. I kind of knew straight away um, we were going to beat Chester and definitely keep a clean sheet like we did. <laughs> and of course when we hit the bar in the first half it wasn't quite going our way. Do you think that the red card changed the game or do you think we were always in control? I still think if they had 11 men on the pitch I still think we would have won the game. I think we were pounding on the pressure and they were just falling back, falling back and they were just, as soon as they were getting it they were playing it back to Blaine O'Malley. Also Reese, um, they got a man sent off, I think it was a penalty was a penalty, yeah, it definitely was a penalty, it was a red card. And then after that, I think we had time on the ball, we had chances and yeah, it's, you know, it's probably good to get another two goals against Chester. <laughs> and now, of course, we're going into the big game against Grimsby and Cheltenham, we've got a big Easter weekend. What, yeah. what do the players need to focus on now? I think we just need to keep doing what we're doing, to be honest. Uh, everything's going perfect at the moment. Um, I think teams will now look at us and think, you know, these Wrexham have got a really good chance, you know, the clean sheets, like I've said, have said it all. Um, and I think Grimsby, you know, be thinking, you know, wait there, Wrexham have got, you know, Got the fire on here, and same as Cheltenham on the Monday. So I think we keep doing what we're doing. Um, you know, enjoy it now this weekend on Monday, Tuesday. Forget about it, and we concentrate on Grimsby. Okay, thanks very much. Cheers. We will play Thank by you. it.